boy. Now, it's sad that Tom Brady's gonna be retiring soon. We just like great quarterbacks like Drew Brees, Philip Rivers, and Eli Manning. And the older elites are leaving, but it's like everyone forgot that Joe Flacco's still in the league. This brings back the most debated question in sports. Is Joe Flacco considered elite? Well, I'm here to answer that question for you on why Joe Flacco is an elite quarterback. Now, what is an elite quarterback? It's someone that shows up in the stats commonly with other great quarterbacks or Hall of Famers. For 16 years, from 2004 to 2019, there were only four quarterbacks to come from the AFC, those being Tom Brady, Peyton Manning, Ben Roethlisberger, and Joe Flacco. In that same time frame, there have been 14 NFC quarterbacks, showing how difficult the AFC was and Joe Flacco beat two of those Hall of Famers to get to the Super Bowl, his one Super Bowl run. There have been a lot of great AFC quarterbacks in that time frame too. Phillip Rivers, Andrew Luck, Deshaun Watson, Patrick Mahomes, Alex Smith, and more. Joe Flacco just didn't make it to the Super Bowl, but won it while winning the Super Bowl MVP and getting the 10th highest passer rating at 124.2 for that Super Bowl. Joe Flacco is tied for the most touchdowns in a single postseason with 11, fourth most passing yards in a single postseason, doing all that while throwing zero interceptions. That's right, Joe Flacco has the most passing yards and touchdowns in a single postseason without throwing an interception. The only other two quarterbacks to throw zero interceptions in playoffs while going to the Super Bowl was Tom Brady and Matt Ryan. So far, Joe Flacco is in an elite company. But let's add in his other postseason stats. His overall career postseason passer rating is 88.6, which puts him at number 18 out of all quarterbacks in NFL history. That's above Eli Manning, Peyton Manning, Ben Roethlisberger, Brett Favre, Steve Young, Philip Rivers, and Troy Aikman. For total touchdown passes in the postseason, he is tied at 13th with 25 touchdown passes. And for passing yards, he's at 18th. Joe Flacco's postseason stats put him in the top 20 in all major passing stats. Well, besides one, he isn't even in the top 40 for interceptions in the postseason. Joe Flacco is also only one of 11 quarterbacks who have won a Super Bowl since 2004. Brady, Big Ben, Peyton Manning, Eli Manning, Drew Brees, Aaron Rodgers, Joe Flacco, Russell Wilson, Nick Foles, Patrick Mahomes, Matthew Stafford. During the same time frame, only eight of those quarterbacks have won the Super Bowl MVP with Flacco being one of them. Just some other fun stats about how great Joe Flacco was as a postseason quarterback. He has 10 wins in the playoffs compared to Drew Brees' eight, a better winning percentage than Peyton Manning, fewer interceptions than Aaron Rodgers, and a more yards per attempt than Tom Brady. Joe Flacco shined when it came to the playoffs, and that's when you can tell if a quarterback is truly a lead or not. Joe Flacco also has done well in the regular season with being tied for 19th all-time in passing yards and 33rd for passing touchdowns. So the next time you and your buddies are talking about elite quarterbacks, don't forget to mention Joe Flacco. Thank you guys for watching this video and let me know what you guys think in the comments. I'll see you guys in the next huddle. Ready?